two people are in the hospital after their hiking group got struck by lightning up at the Grand Canyon. Pretty crazy yeah. stuff. With monsoon season in full swing, the big question is, what should you do if you're caught on the trails and an unexpected lightning storm is rolling in. Brianna Whitney's in studio. Smart to think about that possibility ahead of time, Brianna. Yeah, you have to. I mean, this is really scary what happened to them. And the monsoon storms in the Grand Canyon can seemingly just come in from nowhere, and that's what can make them even more dangerous. But whether you're in the canyon or hiking here in the valley, there are similar scenarios and things to remember that can help keep lightning away from you. The bolt startled everyone. We received a 911 call right after a really loud thunderclap, and we we all saw the the lightning bolt uh, strike. What Grand Canyon officials would soon find out was a lightning bolt struck four hikers at the Bright Angel Trailhead on the South Rim. At first, a 30-year-old and 28-year-old were found unconscious, but one of them came too. The other needed CPR, and she was transported by ambulance to Flagstaff Medical Center, now recovering at a regional burn center. Two others drove themselves to a Grand Canyon clinic. They likely didn't even realize they were in a highly dangerous area when the storm hit. The most risky place to be is standing right on the rim's edge. You know, the uh, lightning tends to strike right at the cliff face there, and it also seeks out the metal guardrails that we have at the various viewpoints. Caitlin Thomas with Grand Canyon Public Affairs says you have to make yourself small if you can't find shelter. But she says you also don't want to lean against any rocks in the canyon because the lightning electricity can go straight through the rock to your body. It's best just to crouch as low as you can. You put your feet together and you take cover uh, while you wait out that storm. That same strategy goes for hiking in the valley too. Phoenix Fire says there are things to keep in mind if you get stuck in a lightning monsoon storm while on a local mountain. Stay away from large objects like trees or lightning poles or like on South Mountain um, at the top they have those um, cell towers and stuff like that. Captain Todd Keller and Thomas say there is one big thing in common here when you should and shouldn't hike Arizona canyons and mountains right now because of this. That lightning can sneak up on you and before it's too late, get those hikes done early in the morning because those storms do develop early in the afternoon. Now, they also both mentioned the 30-30 rule. So what is that? If you see a lightning strike and hear a thunderclap within 30 seconds of that, find cover or crouch down immediately. If there is more than 30 seconds between the lightning and the thunder, then you likely have time to hike out and get to a safer place. Some really good advice. So how are those hikers doing tonight? Well, luckily, they all survived this. They yeah. have had fatalities from lightning strikes right. in the Grand Canyon, but they said all of them are in stable condition tonight. Oh, hopefully they'll pull through okay. Right. Brianna, thank you. Great advice.